Hey Popeye, Muse Link are the modest link With the latest topic and the hottest thing Subscribe, subscribe, make the phone go ping Boss a like, boss a like, now nah charge a thing At the latest Greetings, greetings viewers and subscribers So, we are now in the parish of Sentan <laughs> Yesterday we had said we were in the parish of Sentan But when the video started, we were still in the parish of Chulani We are now in the parish of Sentan We are still heading towards well we are heading to Duns River Falls also in the parish of Sentan now me notice some of you you know <laughs> me notice some of you are quarrel about how the one papaya takes so long to reach at Duns River Falls but let me tell you no something let me tell you no something nobody feel like you can boot me up you know and make me go drive fast and get no speeding ticket no, you can't do that. <laughs> so, continue to sit back, continue to relax and enjoy the view and enjoy the journey with me. Yeah, man, we're so rich, you know, but you know, we have to slow down the video a bit so that persons can enjoy the view. If we were to allow the video to run in real time, we would have reached there already, but we have to slow it down. So, work with the program. We're so rich, man. Don't you want to run away? <laughs> so, we had promised this video from yesterday but we had to ensure that we confirmed a few details before we released it later on today we are going to be dropping the news roundup for western jamaica and let me tell you something in less than 24 hours at least 13 persons were shot they were shot in the parishes of trelawney westmoreland and St. James. So far, of the 13 persons who were shot, at least six of them died as a result of being shot. Later on today, we are going to be giving you the details. I don't even know if all of those reports can hold in a one video, but stand by for the video later on. The intro. The intro. Yesterday, we told you that the name of the person was killer bees we made a mistake it's actually stinger bees not killer bees stinger bees you know why i said killer bees right yeah man you, you know exactly why i said killer bees but the name of the artist is stinger bees on the spot news media yesterday i heard you sending out condolences to me it's greatly appreciated enough respect and for all the persons who have been sending condolences. I have been reading all of the messages. But trust me. If I was to sit down and respond to every message that I get. Or every comment on YouTube. I wouldn't have any time to do any research. And bring the stories to you. So if you see me don't respond. Don't feel like I am neglecting you. Or I am ungrateful. Or anything like that. I have to just read. And skip and read and skip and read. Please, understand me, alright? It is greatly appreciated. I have been reading. I have been listening. Thank you a lot. Now, into the story. Young Devante Lindo. He was popularly known as Dev. He was only 17 years old. Now, Dev, he's from a place named Ashton in the parish of Westmoreland. Ashton... It is up in the hills in the Betteltown police area. Dev, he would be celebrating his 18th birthday in June this year. Now Dev, he has some family members at a place named Cherry Gardens in Hendon Narwood in Montego Bay in the parish of St. James. He even have a half-sister living in the area. Now you would have heard me talking about that man that you are seeing on your screen. His name is Delano Spence. He was popularly known as Lanny. Not Dodos, like we said before. But we are going to tell you some more about Dodos. Stand by for that. So he is known as Lanny, not Dodos. So here is the connection with Lanny and Dev. They both shared a sister. Meaning, Dev's father is Lanny's sister sister father and 
Lani's mother is Dev's sister mother. Are you following me? Let me repeat it and try and understand. And I, well, I hope you understand. But let me repeat. Dev's father is Lani's sister father. And Lani's mother is Dev's sister mother. I hope you get it. So it is said that Lani and Dev, they shared a close brother-like relationship. So in January 2022, Dev went to stay with his relatives at Hendon Narwood because he wanted to get a job and only farming is available in Ashton where he lived. Dev, he got a job at a supermarket in Montego Bay. And let me tell you this from now. We have not received any information that Dev was involved in any criminality. None whatsoever. So Dev started working at a supermarket in Montego Bay. We are told that he was a very good worker who was willing to learn. A female now got in the picture. We are not going to say whether or not she works at the same supermarket as Dev, but Dev saw her and liked her. They started communicating. But guess what? This female, she had a man. A very jealous man. We are told that he asked his girlfriend about Dev. But she told him, they are just good friends, nothing else. So Friday night, March 25th, 2022, Dev finished working and was outside of the supermarket where he worked. He and the same girl, yeah man, the same one we told you that he liked, they stood outside of the supermarket and was talking. Now, whilst they were talking, her phone rang. She answered, hello? It was her man on the phone. Yo, me not tell if you stop talking to the boy there. A style, you a try style man in my youth. <laughs> now let me ask you something. Did you know that most guys in some areas, they refer to their girlfriend as my youth? You didn't know that? Well, you learned something new today. The first time I became aware of it, I too was shocked. Yeah man, a lot of young guys in certain areas, they refer to their girlfriend as my youth. <laughs> so, our information is that this girl, her man was across the road and he saw his girlfriend and Dev talking. So he called her, she went across the road to him and they both left. About 40 minutes later, Dev, he reached home. He was pounced on and shot by hoodlums. Our information is that the police, they are following some strong leads into the theory that this may have something to do with jealousy. Are you following me? So if you look on your screen, you notice I haven't removed the logos. Let's give credit where credit is due. That Instagram page named It's a Blast, I say this without any fear of contradiction. If you are interested in the news in Jamaica or even worldwide, that is the page to visit on Instagram. They are the best thing since sliced bread. It's a blast. Big up on yourself. So this photograph is courtesy of It's a blast. Now, the man on the right, his name is Damian Minto. He was popularly known as Kappa. He was only 22 years old and he lived at Warika Drive at Hendon Narwood. Hold on, I soon tell you something else about Kappa. Now, the young man on the left, his name is Lenroy Martin. He was popularly known as Antsman. He was 25 years old and he also lived at Warika Drive, Hendon Narwood in Montego Bay. So by now you would have known that both Kappa and Antsman, they were killed Saturday morning as well. So here is what we are learning. Kappa, he was in the game. He made a lot of money out of the game. But he didn't waste it like what most other youngsters do. And don't you ever think I'm trying to justify anything. I am just stating the facts. Alright? 
So nobody come with your judgmental thinking and say, oh, the one papaya justifies scamming. No, nobody with that. I'm just stating the facts. Kappa's father, he used to work at a funeral home establishment in Montego Bay. So what Kappa did was he opened a funeral home in Narwood out of some of the money that he made in the game. And he gave that funeral home to his father to run. The name of that funeral home? Funeral home. Kappa, it is said that he had some level of respect in the area. And a lot of persons, both young and old, they looked up to him. So Saturday morning, March 26, 2022, two things were happening at the same time. Dev's father, he was at the Freeport police station talking to detectives at the station read the shooting death of his son, Devante Lindo, popularly known as Dev. At the same time, Delano Spence, popularly known as Lanny, and two other men, they were on their way to Warwick Drive. Our information, well, we are getting words that Lanny, his intention was to go and have a chat with Kappa about the death of Dev who he considered to be his brother. We are getting conflicting reports right here. There are reports that are saying that Lanny, he had a gun. There are reports that are saying that it's only the two other men who had guns. Now, here is where the name Dodos comes up. It is said that one of the hoodlums who was amongst the tree, he is called Dodos. That is the word on the ground. Dodos and Lanny, it is said that they were very good friends. Now, one of the guns that these guys were carrying, it is a Glock 17 pistol with a fun switch. You ever hear of that before? When you finish this video, just type in Glock 17 with fun switch. Two separate words, fun switch. That switch or chip, it allows the Glock 17 to be either semi-automatic or fully automatic so these three guys they went to the shop where the group of persons were Lanny it is said that he was at the front we are told that he said something to Kappa it is said that the guys behind him they opened gunfire there are reports that Lanny also fired there are reports that he did not fire you following me I'm just stating the facts you know no like I said earlier, one of the guys, the Glock 17 that he was carrying, it had on the fun switch or the chip. It is said that there was also an extended magazine with over 30 rounds in that Glock. The gun, we are told, was on fully automatic. When you go and do the research on YouTube, you will see what that does. As a result, one of the bullets hit Lanny at his right side. Right at the back section of his right side. Now remember we told you that Dev's father, he was at the Freeport police station. Well, he was the person who informed the police about what just happened at Warica Drive. Because he got a call that Lanny and two other guys just went to Warica Drive to take revenge for Dev. And the guys from Warica Drive killed him and pulled him down into a dirt truck. But that wasn't what happened. He was shot by one of the shooters. And when they were escaping, they pulled Lanny down in the dirt truck. But they realized it was too late. So they had to run, leaving him. There is more to come. Lots more to come. But in the meantime, the mayhem continues. Blessed love, everybody. Quick silver sin, if we just unite, what a country this will be. Yeah. 
go me warm me country back to me me country back Cry me to mash up Jamaica To me not say my mash up Jamaica Jamaica's mash up Jamaica Oh Jamaica me sweet Jamaica Cry me to mash up Jamaica To me not say my mash up Jamaica Jamaica's mash up Jamaica Oh Jamaica me sweet Jamaica 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 the land of the sun Jamaica become now the land of the gun East and North and South when me turn Country and town man a play a blood a run Murder, don't you be a be me here them a murder